so great to be back with a Sabesachi collection. It got me really excited and we started this whole endeavor in terms of getting into a journey of another great collection of Sabesachi's wallpapers. It's like a fabric adorning the entire uh, wall with patterns coming all over the place. Sabya really took us on an adventure through India to look at the patterns, the textures, the colours, the ideas uh, that have inspired him and us. Collaboration happened with uh, GM Centex and Asian Paints uh, a year back. We do a lot of mixed techniques and a lot of pattern on pattern and a lot of layer on layer. That's what even he enjoys and that's what even we are quite known for. In my mind, uh, this is one of the most sophisticated collections, not just from Sabesachi or from Nilaya, but from any company anywhere in the world. He wanted a lot of uh, handcrafted techniques because India is known for its craft and he wanted, always said that the collection needs to look more hand done rather than more machines. So it was very, very, uh, the brief was very, very nice. We saw the entire process and when the designs were coming with he being at Calcutta, we being at Bombay and sampling going at Manchester, you know, it was amazing in terms of how that entire process was working. So I think it's a wonderful collaboration between Sabia, Asia Paints and ourselves and we're delighted to work with such a talented creative team um, and be involved with printing of such beautiful designs. It was quite uh, interesting to understand uh, how he's trying to connect uh, the apparel world into the home world and uh, continue the sensibility of his brand. It's been some real hard work over the last uh, three months when we have kind of worked with it. So many designs, so many modifications, so many colorways in terms of what we think, in terms of what we got. Much of the work that Sabia does um, it's a collection that will bring not just your home to life, but connect you in the most uh, primordial and emotional and sensitive way to your own roots.